First Tunisia and now Egypt is tasting its own dose of people power. Waves of protesters braving tear gas on the banks of the River Nile. They're calling for the downfall of Hosni Mubarak, Egypt's president for the last 30 years. They marched through Cairo until water cannon pushed them back. Protesters responding by chasing it and trying to climb on board. One police estimate put the number of demonstrators at 15,000 inside the capital alone, with more protests in other towns and cities. Officials say three people have died in the unrest. Although not on the scale of Tunisia, such defiance here is rare and could mark the beginning of something bigger, perhaps regime change. We need to, this regime to go out. We need to repeat the same. The same scenario happened in Tunis now. All the community is exploding now. But crucially, the unpopular President Mubarak still enjoys the army's support. And he may be hoping that if the protesters are allowed to let off steam, that might calm things down.